Hello guys, welcome back to technically the last unboxing for Trap Team for now. There's another thing to come sometime tomorrow, which is the 3DS version, which I just don't have yet. And there's our characters from the last video. Well, some of them. Hey there, Blades, looking sharp. Yep. So our very last thing should be short and sweet. It is. Let's get both. Oh, that one still has the price on. Don't know why, but I'm taking that off. Just because it ruins the fun. Our last one is... Two... Trapmasters. Of Earth and Life. Um, in this game, you need a trapmaster of each element to be able to unlock... Like, the elemental gates. Which is kind of a cop-out, but... It's what they decided. Um... We already have fire and water, so that's two of eight. This will be four of eight. Hopefully I should be getting, well, I'll be getting one more with the 3DS version. Hopefully should be getting another coming with that, but that seems doubtful because of the company being not very good. And then I think that's it. Oh no, there's an, another one on its way in the mail. And then the last one, which is magic, it hasn't been announced yet. So, let's just get into these. Wallop, Series 1. Bushwhack, Series 2. Honestly, I wasn't very thrilled about the... Either of the two... I'm going from the light again. Either of the two life ones. But I did like Wallop. Wallop's cool. So, let's get into these. Problem is... How does one get into it? One gets into it by having to rip it open. That's, from what everyone's been able to find out, the only way really into them. So as much as it kills me to do it, as much as it kills us to do it, because I can't do it. Oh, can you? No, you can't. Ah, well. Rip, tear, rend, sunder. And then you do that, which again, a lot of people have said these aren't very good, they're very sharp, and that goes on the floor, you go there, that gets thrown on the floor, there's our wallop card, which has 190, 140, 180, which, pretty good. And there's our sticker. Ooh, zoomed the wrong way. Yeah, there's our wallop sticker. Card there. Hello again, Blades. Oh! Stand up for a second while I get wallop out of his plastic. Again, like the other trimester, surprised at that being so flexible. No rattles, good. Doesn't feel loose, that seems good. Paint works nice on it, or at least it seems it at first glance. You're out the way. That's one pretty cool trapmaster. Not fantastic or anything, but pretty cool. <laughs> and the trap symbol. And from what people can tell, I'm pretty sure that he's a Mabu. A very, very big one that has Traptanium. But Mabu nonetheless. Mm, zoom out. Put you over here. And let's open our bushwhack. Or oh, we had sentence. Or oh, we had statement perhaps. It is a shame that you have to literally rip these apart so much to get into them. I hope that someone figures out another way to do this. Not for me really, I don't tend to leave things in boxes. But this must kill collectors. So, do that. Try to not have the toy go flying. 
onto the floor. Everybody do the dinosaur. <laughs> do do do. Everybody walk the dinosaur. Bam 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 on the floor. There's a bushwhack sticker. You're gonna zoom? No, not zoom. Focus on that. There we go. Obscuring the lighting again, but whatever. 220, 70, 180, 50. That means that he's pretty strong and pretty fast. That sounds quite good. Now let's get you out of your very protective packaging. And then put the packaging on, on the floor. So for this trap master, no shoes. No shoes. No shoes for him. No shoes. Very smug look. Traptanium axe. Or Labrius, is it? I don't know. It has a name for a massive axe like that. Turn around. There's his acorns, which are part of his attack. Now I wonder what he is. He sort of looks human. But if you think of the idea of like the horns as being part of his hat or something. Then he looks quite human. But one, two, three, four toes, four fingers, probably not human. But whatever. Like I said, this is a really short video because it's just about the trap masters and hopefully in the next few days I'll be able to show you the other two or three that I should be getting uh, well and you'll be seeing them in game as well so thanks again for watching and yeah see you next time bye bye hello everyone again sort of just a little add on to the end of the video look what I got a hold of ignore all the stuff in the background yeah, obviously I realised that the video that I unboxed the Trap Masters hasn't been released yet when I've received this, so I thought, tag this on the end of it. So, let's have a look at our Nitro Crypt King. Which, of course, you've got to rip into the box for, which is horrible. I can hear the collectors crying out there. Don't know what they're doing outside, but apparently they're outside my house crying. Which way is it? This side? No, it's the other side. No casualties there. Let's get our card and sticker. Our card shows, is it going to focus? It's a different day, come on, you can focus on this. Nah, doesn't like it. Well, you can see, basically I can explain it to you. He has 220, 220, 210 for attack, which might be whatever. 210 for attack, 210 for defense, 120 for speed and only 60 for luck so he's not very lucky no matter what the lighting is it just isn't happy is it there you go some pretty cool artwork and statses the statses masters there's our sticker 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 yeah, as you'd expect. And then, of course... Our Trap Master. I just threw that on the floor. Now, Crook King's an interesting one, since he was originally meant to be, like, a giant. Well, he was one of the concept artwork giants. There's a bit of gold on his sword. Let's look at him. He looks pretty cool. I wasn't sure whether I wanted the nitro or the regular. Oh, he's got the nose of the thing. 
Puasco. But, and this is a really stupid little detail for me, this bit on the back, can we get you to focus? Nah, there we go. That bit on the regular is like black, was it black, white, black, white, black, white, black, white, down the stripes. Which I don't really like. I thought it looked really weird. So I ended up going with this, which has golden white. So, yeah. But it's sort of, it's got a, like a sort of Egyptian theme to it. So it works with the gold of like the sarcophagus. Plus he has a cool sword. So yeah, that was just a little add-on at the end. Just so you can see. New one. Hopefully tomorrow, tomorrow in my time. Actually, yeah, it'll probably be tomorrow in your time as well. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> That's me. So, yeah, hopefully tomorrow we should be unboxing the 3DS starter, which hopefully should have two Trap Masters with it, if the company that I bought this from hasn't cheated me. But we'll see. If they haven't, then it'll be a positive surprise. Either way, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.